playing on Paradiso. This is uh, one of the default Forge World variants that the Bungie guys have, have cooked up in Forge World that will be available on the disc. It's a larger map. Uh, looks like, and yes, we all get the loadouts of, of choice here, pro loadouts. I do like Sprint. Uh, let's go with this guy here and see if we can... Oh. Nice, he waited for me. You never want to drive off in an empty Warthog, obviously. So Paradiso takes place on the island, one of the island uh, backdrop that we have within Forge World. Um, you know, up in the distance you can see some of the other aspects of this map, but this is actually a... I've never played a 4v4v4v4 4v4 v4 game on it, but it's, it's a little, little bit of a larger size map. It'll support 12-16 uh, to 16 generally. And you see in the upper right corner one of the subtle changes uh, to reach, which people might remember from the beta, is a Warthog turret actually will overheat. So just going to keep a little bit of an eye on that. Uh, see how those red those bars start to fill up, and once it, if it goes all the way to overheating, it's going to lock up for a few seconds. I'm going to be unable to fire. I'm not quite able to communicate with my driver here, so we can't really talk about targets. I'm just sort of driving blind here. I'll get out in a minute and try. Oh, there's a sprinter. Suck it, pudding. Uh oh, Banshee times. It's a low flying Banshee right there. Another, this is a, another vehicle centric madhouse playground, it looks like. Can't really stay still long enough to kill anyone, though. Oh. So that's not generally a great tactic. Uh, you know, the Mongoose has no offensive capabilities, so. Chasing down an opponent without anyone uh, riding in tow with, with a weapon is kind of foolhardy. Oh, here comes a banshee again. Let's see if I can sit down a little bit. Wow, he's <laughs> doing some pretty awesome uh, evasive maneuvers into the face of a rock there. Alright, I got a good driver here. Might have to get out in a minute though. See, we've, this is a base here, all constructed from various forge parts. Oh, somebody's decided to take the mongoose again. Not a good idea. Really, unless you're playing like a flag or a race game, trying to get somewhere really quickly, uh, there's no reason to ever drive a mongoose in a Slayer game. Uh oh, high ground. That's 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 bail. Abort, abort. Sprint to cover. Avenger. Got myself a little metal there. Yeah, so remember too, just like in the beta, the reticles, uh, whether you love it or hate it, reticle bloom is here to stay in reach. So, you know, the more you spam the trigger, the uh, less accurate it is. So, depending on your distance to target, every weapon sort of has a cadence and a rhythm to, to maintain maximum accuracy. I can say that. Obviously, I'm not really an MLG caliber player, but. I know what I should do when I'm playing. Let's see what's going on here. So right now, on my radar there, that, that little triangle dot is letting me know someone is above me. Uh, so there is an enemy within my proximity here, but not on the same playing level as me. Ah, concussion rifle. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I think I'll keep the DMR, because this is a big map and there's a lot of range fight going on. Ooh, we got people rocking elites. Oh, and I got assassinated. The downside of scoped fighting, no radar, uh, no motion tracker. It's a good point, though. In these custom games, uh, if you want to play mix, mix together uh, elites and Spartans together, you can do that. In your player setting, there's an option for uh, a toggle for preferred species. And if you flip it to elite, uh, in any kind of custom game mode that allows you to play as an elite model, uh, it'll default to an elite rather than a Spartan. Let's get up here to advantage point. I'm not actually sure what's going on in this map and where everybody is. It's kind of, kind of quiet at the moment. Huge man cannon. Oh, there's a there's a there's a dude up there. Let's see if we can get the drop on him. Hmm. Yes, he doesn't see us. Let's pay him in general favor for the assassination. Oh. I didn't assassinate him. Great. And I didn't kill him. All right. Well, I got that guy at least. There's a bunch of dudes down there. That turret is not going to kill me at that range. Not a good choice. Ooh. Scorpion. Oh, wrong seat. <laughs> Classic mistake. Oh, we got in, though. 
That's not good. I don't want to be a part of that. Oh, it looks like that dude's going to board him, though. Let's go down there. There is some fall damage in reach, but I don't think this fall is going to be too bad on me. Yeah, just a little bit of my health. I'll go sniper, why not? Not that proficient with it, but I might be able to pull off a kill or two. Oh, no shields. Great teamwork. I don't think I've seen another blue guy, have I? I'm not really demonstrating the uh, fundamentals of team play. Oh, there we go. There's a teammate. Getting ping from green dudes. Alright. Friendly scorpion. That's a good sign. Oh, that didn't last long. It's that dude. Yeah. So jetpack's kind of a mixed bag. You're pretty vulnerable when you're just hovering up there against the light sky. You know, we played on this map back in the office one day, and another cool setting you can do in custom games is you can turn on unlimited energy for armor abilities. So you can pretty much feather your jetpack indefinitely and uh, spend almost the entire time in the air if you want to. It's one of the many things you can do to mix up Reach's gameplay through the custom settings. Let's see if I can get somebody else here. Oh, there's that. There's that elite again. Yeah, I don't actually know the default weapon spawns on this map. But with these loadouts, battle rifle, or, uh, sorry, not battle rifle, uh, surprise, uh, our DMR and Magnum, I actually don't really need any other weapons, technically speaking. In case I need to take a vehicle out. Yeah, there's a dude right there. I'll just bounce it in the corner. I don't even know what's going on here. It's getting crazy. I'm out. I'm reloading. Double beatdown. Still happens occasionally, but I'll take I'll take the kill. Right? Just trying not to go negative. So zero is not negative. Uh, there's that jetpack crusader again. Uh, a little out of range. I think I'll save my ammo here. Oh, that's it. How do we do? We got nine. Not bad. Our team still lost, though. Look at that. Two guys with one kill. Thanks, guys. Way to carry it.